Despite having hundreds and thousands of visitors a year, St Fagans is also home to some fantastic wildlife. The beautiful woodlands, buildings and farmlands are traditionally managed, which allows room for the local wildlife to flourish. St Fagans is not just a place to see farm animals, but also a really great place to see Welsh wildlife. This unique habitat is really important because it provides a home for some of Britain's most endangered animals. Throughout the year you can spot hundreds of different plants and animals. If you'd like to take a closer look, take a stroll along our woodland walk or watch some of our live web cameras. Many of the old buildings have become homes for animals, such as these nesting swallows. Or this baby blackbird being fed by its dad. At the tannery, the water pits which were once used to treat leather are now a haven for all kinds of aquatic life, including newts. This great crested newt is endangered, but it can be found in many of the small pools and ponds at St Fagans. During the spring, you can see colourful dragonflies and damselflies emerging and dancing around the water's edge. In the night, another group of mysterious animals begin to flutter. St Fagans is a great place for bats and every year these rare lesser horseshoe bats return to raise their babies and sing their wonderful songs. It's not only old buildings that the bats like. Over 400 pipistrelle bats roost above the staff office block. And down at the fish ponds, Dorbenton's bats can be heard feeding on insects close to the surface of the water. Watch them swoop in on their prey over the ponds. We are very lucky to have such fantastic wildlife at St Fagans, and we are committed to protecting them for us all to enjoy.